to another part of my let of my uh Pokemon Crystal Solar Run. So since we're in Goldenrod City, we're gonna go back here and we're gonna fight this trainer. Because we missed it. And you can only fight this one at night, so that's why I wait until nighttime just to fight this guy. So last time we got to Goldenrod City, um yeah, my cat's crawling. Okay, we're just going to put Togepi. Okay. Oh, yeah, you can go out and then you see your Pokemon there. That's pretty cool. Um. Okay, this is the biggest Pokemart. And we're going to... Okay, we gotta go to the fifth floor. Like one. Oh, this is where you can get ice punch. So there's ice punch. Oh wow! Look at all the others. Okay. So we're just gonna go ahead and. Go back down. There we go. Um. So. Here's some. We can do some stuff here. Going around the city. Um. We can get a radio card. So this one's actually quite easy. Yes. Okay, I got it wrong. That's why I end up loading my save state. There we go. Got the radio um card card. So um yeah, this is where you get the golden rod train, but we can't use that right now. But what we could do is we can go for here. And we're going to battle these guys. There you go. So yeah, I got um Ice Punch, which is going to be one of Jaws' main moves. Which is Ice Punch. Let me get um Ice Punch. Let's see, where is it? Oh, there it is. There you go. Let's take away Rage. There we go. Now Jaws has Ice Punch on us, so we're going to go ahead and, you know. So. If he does, if he has like a grass, if we get a grass Pokemon, I'll show it off. But I can't really with, with a Steel type. So, yeah. With this guy, I can show you. There we go. See? Ice Punch does a pretty good good damage. So we're just going to go over here and find the coin case. It's not that I'm going to use it, but you never know. If I was doing a walkthrough, I would use it. So we're just going to battle this guy. Well, I have... I do apologize for not gaming or sooner in the day. I was really busy with other stuff. So, yeah. I was pretty busy. So, yeah. Okay, guys. Um there is a place where you where you can get your bike. I think it's Yeah, there's a gym which I'm not going to go to the gym right now. I think there is a bike place down here. Yeah, it is a bike shop. So you go here, you talk to this guy, and we get the bicycle, which is going to be pretty useful. Um, um, yeah, let's go heal first, and then we're going to go take on the um, Goldenrod City Gym. There we go. Now, usually it's pretty fairly easy. I mean, if you have a fighting type, this should be easy.
And most of the, and these are normal type Pokemon, so this should be easy too. So I hope you guys all enjoyed Fire Red, my, my Let's Play of it. I might do one, like a walkthrough on Emerald or Sapphire. I'm not too sure yet, though. So we're just going to battle these trainers. Meowth. I was going to do a Meowth only run. That'd be quite cool. Like a Meowth only run. I mean, I think there, I think somebody has done a Meowth only run, but I just don't know if there is a Meowth only run. That would be epic. Okay. Is there a trainer down here? Uh, no. Okay. And we can battle this one. Yeah. There we go. All right. So I'm going to battle this girl. There we go. There we go. Okay, level scary face. No. I'm going to be using physical moves, so that's why I said no to those, because I use physical moves. Okay, off screen, I'm going to go heal, so I'll be right back. Okay, guys, we're back. Um, off screen, I went to go heal, so now we're going to go face the gym leader, Whitney. Oh, I didn't think to buy any potions. Well, I think we should be okay. So I'm just going to save state just in case if it gets hairy. Clefairy. I'm going to be using Ice Punch. Oh, it's going to throw solid, so. There we go. Miltank. Miltank gave me a really hard time. But since it's frozen solid, this shouldn't be an issue. There we go. We defeated her. Ah, <laughs> Wow, she's like she's like a little baby. She's like crying. She's like, Wah. Okay, well, anyway, we get the badge when you talk to her again. We get attract, which is honestly the worst move. That's just me, though. It's the worst move you can ever use. I mean, it helps. Maybe in some stances, but still. Okay, so we talked to this girl, and she's looking for her um, sister or something, so... Anyway, let's go back and heal, and then we'll continue on. Alright, we're on this route, so we're going to now fight these trainers. Full picks. There we go. So... I'm still looking into doing Pokemon, um, um, probably Pokemon Ruby or Sapphire. I'm not sure which one I want to do yet, though. I might probably do Ruby first, but I don't really know yet. If you want to comment on, you know, what Pokemon game I should play first in Hoenn region, such as Sapphire, Emerald, or Ruby, let me know. And I'll look into them. There we go. 29. Looks like looks like our jaws is about to evolve soon. Not too sure. Ooh, Diglett. Yeah, these Pokemon are really under level. They should be around the 20s. But, you know, I'm like almost 30. Well, I will be 30 levels high in a few more battles. There we go. There we go. Magmar. Well, at least Magmar is like a decent level. Oh, level 2 Voltorb. <laughs> level 6. Wow, this Pokemon, these Pokemon are really under level.
There we go. So we're gonna, just gonna go right here. Ooh, Jigglypuff. Okay, level 30. There you go, for alligator. Probably for alligator looks beast. Ooh, Venonette. Okay, so we're gonna use cut and get through here. So we're gonna battle this guy. Abra. You're going down. Another Abra. You're gonna go down as well. Yeah. I mean, I'll probably play a Hoenn region um, game after this. So, like, after this, I'll... I'll see what one you guys want me to do. Like, if you guys want me to do, you know, Ruby or Sapphire, what? Yeah. I mean, I'll do one of those. Okay, we talked to this girl and we need to go oh, back to Goldenrod City. So we're going to go back there. Oh, yeah. If I was doing a walkthrough, I would have got um, Thunder Punch and Ice Punch if... Um, and fire punch if I had, um, if I had a spot. Oh, there is, um, there's Pidgey and Pidgeotto. Okay, I'm going to use ice punch for Pidgeotto. There we go. Okay. TMO4. Oh, yeah. I Can you fight this guy? Oh, yeah, you can, only at nighttime. Ooh, Growlithe. If I was doing a walkthrough, I would have definitely picked Growlithe for my team. Okay, level 31. Another Growlithe. You're going to still stay out here. There we go. Okay. All right, so we're back here. Um, We do need to get the Squirt Bottle. Then we get to we talk to that girl and we get the squirt bottle. Which of course I'm gonna use, so yep. So we need to go to, to another city, so we're gonna head through there right now. Ooh, drowsy. I would have picked Red Drowsy for my psychic type if I was doing a walkthrough. We use a squirt bottle and so do I. Also level 20 as well. Okay, there we go. Alrighty. There it is. We're at this route, so we're going to battle these guys. Well, girls. Clefairy. There. Jigglypuff. So we're going to talk to this guy. I'm recording this at almost 2 o'clock at night. There we go. Okay, I'm not going to go there. We're at Ecrotique City now. So, talk to this guy. It's Bill. Bill, Bill, Bill Nye, the science guy. He talks about this, you know, time capsule, a golden rod or something. I don't even know. But there you go. We just healed our Pokemon. So, I guess but I'm not going to take on the gym. But there's this, like, place where you can go talk to this guy. He talks about Sweet Coon. So... I guess we can, you know, explore this area just for a bit. Okay, nothing over here. Oops. Okay, so we're just going to go over here and talk to um 
Oh, there's our rival, Beavis. Hee hee hee. Wonder where Butthead is. <laughs> All right. Um. If we don't have time to do the gym this video, we'll do the gym in the next one. Okay. You talk to him, and he's like, Oh, I didn't know you were here. Okay, Haunter. Haunter's gonna be easy to take down, which he is. 32 now. Magamite. Water gun, there you go. Oh, takes two. There you go. Bayleaf. Ice punch. There you go. Oh, let me do another one. There you go. Zubat, Ice Punch. Alrighty. He just says about the legendary Pokemon, fall for the hole, he says, serves you right. No, it should be the other way around, asshole. Oh, sweet coon. Yeah, I mean, if I was um, doing a walkthrough, I would have caught the legendary Pokemon if I was doing a walkthrough. He talked to this guy about sweet coon. And he thank you so much, so... Okay, I guess he runs away. <laughs> okay. Um... We're gonna be doing... Not this... Not the gym. But we're gonna be doing this little... Oh, where is... Oh, yeah, my cat's on me. That's why. Okay. So you talk to this guy, and he said you can... If you defeat all the, the Komodo... The um girl over right here, kimono girls um, he'll give you, he'll give you something. So you talk to this one. This one's got Jolteon. It's got mostly EV evolutions. So that's Jolteon, which I miss um using him in Fire Red. Vaporeon, which Vaporeon's one of my favorites. Thirty free now. I'll probably do the gym in the next video. And then we talk to this girl. And she's got Umbreon. Which Umbreon, oops, didn't mean to use that. Umbreon's a dark type. There you go. And then we got um this girl. She's got Espeon, which is a psychic type. And then Flareon, which is a fire type. Boom. We're almost at level 34. Okay, so we talk to this guy and he gives us Surf. Alrighty. So we're going to teach Surf. Although we can't use it until the next badge has been collected, but... I'm going to take care of Water Gun because, you know, Surf does more. So, let's going to go heal. Next time, guys, we'll take on the Ecritique City Gym. So, yeah, that will be something we're going to do in the next.